Hi guys! So today we are here in the Wisdom LA. It is a fully immersive art park. Let's see some art. Wisdom. Wisdom LA, but it's actually called Samskara. Oh, yeah, Samskara. Yeah. Samskara. Samskara. Don't know. But uh, it was pretty good. It was a very different and new experience. Um, yeah. A lot of art pieces. So if you're really into art, digital art, VR art, being in. I don't know. An interactive environment? Yeah, but then also making you feel like you're on something trippy. It's definitely made for people who are on something. And there were people who were on something. <laughs> it's very fun and unique and new. Um, definitely like an installation exhibit. Mm -hmm. For $25, it's, it's yeah. okay. Tickets are $29, but oh, then if you get 29. a gold star, it's $25. Okay. It's something worth seeing. Yeah, yeah. Know. And they have some like food there. Yeah. Um, although it's probably going to be a little overpriced, but you know, they have some stuff there. I would recommend it. the vegan sushi if you are trying something new because that was pretty good. It was like a veggie tempura yeah. sort of thing. Yeah. So visit Samskara. Wisdom LA. So I'm kind of struggling to find out what I want to say but we spent like about an hour there. People say you might spend like two hours there. Yeah, I guess it really depends. If you stay inside the dome where, you know, they have these effects on you. you oh, the overhead stuff. Yeah, yeah. You can stay there for 30 minutes, long time, I don't know. Yeah. So, but yeah. for just general walkthrough, if you're just trying to check this place out, it should only take you less than an hour. Yeah, I really like the first two domes, i say, because the first one, like, just a bunch of uh, trippy stuff yeah. that you can, like, move, and then you see, like, different images. And the next one is just, like, um, just, like, straight up art, yeah. which is cool, that's fine. Um, but like when I was in the second dome, I felt like... You were in a museum? Well, no, that, uh, what I mean is that when, because it's shaped like a dome, there's a bunch of like audio tricks or whatever, and I don't know if they're doing it on purpose, but if you just pay attention, you can hear like other people talking, coming from above you, and it's just like the sound bouncing. I think that's on purpose think, though. Yeah. Because they try to make this environment very like, in spiritual mind bending yeah. and very like in tune with being lost in yeah. a space. But what I'm saying is that I like that and that's I think that adds to the environment. Yeah. Which is why it's one of my more favorite domes. Mm -hmm. The third one adds VR whatever. Yeah, the stuff. third one's kinda like it's the loud like kids were Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's like more, VR tricks, yeah, whatever. It's more just Who cares like, about that. Yeah. Cause it's not like Interesting yeah, I mean, VR? you can move things around, like, I guess, go like that, and then it, yeah, it's yeah. Like VR stuff. Um, but the fourth one with the dome above you and you look up, yeah. I thought that was, like, a little falling flat. Yeah, I think it could be improved. Yeah, or maybe, like, we weren't doing it right, but we just sat there next to everyone else, but... There's like three projectors and they're all projecting into one image above you and it looks like there's like a double image. I think it could be, I mean it should be VR, right? Because you're... Not VR, 3D. Oh, okay, 3D, 3D, whatever, yeah. Because there are effects that are coming right at you, right? So mm -hmm. I feel like it could, it could be yeah. improved. It could be something cool, yeah. I guess. But I mean, even when you're there with just, you know, nothing on, it's still nice. It's it's they have these couches that couples can lay on. So yeah, yeah. A date night, I think it could be good. Yeah. For us, it was just kind of like, 
We're just there to check out. I think people can meditate in there though. Like the first dome had like these three people who were just sitting there talking about things. They were definitely on something. Yeah, but they kind of like set the mood for what we would expect. <laughs> Oh, and that tunnel in the beginning? Pretty cool stuff. Oh, the mirror. Yeah. Yeah, the mirror wall. Definitely, it sets the bar. Overall, I think it's it's okay. You don't have to go to this. That's that's my opinion. Yeah. If you have nothing to do, check it out. Once in a lifetime thing. Sure. I wouldn't come back. Repeat it. Yeah. Another time. Oh, I wonder if they are like aluminum images. I didn't touch any of the stuff, but if you can... I wonder what material it's made out of, basically. Anyway. Okay. See you guys on the next one. Bye. Later.